Stoneworms Tech Channel here, and today I'm doing a bit about the Moto G Power 5G. So the Moto G Power 5G is a new smartphone from Motorola. It's been announced. Uh, it's supposed to get released on April 13th, I believe it is. So today is uh, April 11th when I am recording this video here. So uh, you know, so if you guys are looking to get a budget 5G smartphone from Motorola, the Moto G Power 5G is the one to check out here. And I believe that this is the first in the Moto G Power series to have 5G, so that is pretty cool. So if you guys like the Moto G Power lineup of friends from Motorola, this phone has 5G on it, so that is really cool. So you, you guys see the phone there front and back. Powerful speed, smooth views coming soon, of course. Uh, so you guys can zoom in here and see the front and back of the phone. You guys got your whole punch your front facing camera there, a piece above that. Back of the phone looks like a all oh, triple camera system. Camera flash. Motorola logo there on the back. So pretty cool. Um, here's the back over here. Closer look at it in the way you guys have a 50 megapixel main camera there. Uh, very nice. Um, Moto, the, Motorola logo, the Motorola logo there on the back. Uh, looks like it's made of all uh, like. It looks like it's like a brushed finish. I don't know if it's made of plastic. Probably is made of plastic. I'm not really sure. It kind of looks reflective there in pictures, but you know. And also got a, a white version here. Pretty cool there. So you guys have a couple of cover couple of different color options. Um, that's the front of it there. Whole points for the front facing camera there. It appears about that power button and bang keys on the right side of the phone. There it is, power button, volume keys, and I believe your power button is also is also your fingerprint sensor as well, I believe. So, uh, yeah. Um, say goodbye to like experience glitch-free gaming, enhanced camera performance, and super smooth app switching on with AG Power 5G Plus. Super fast 5G lets you download shows in seconds. Stream with virtually no buffering and video chat without lag. Visual upgrade here, y'all guys can come. Y'all guys can, y'all guys can compare the different refresh rates. This has a 120 hz refresh rate, so that is pretty cool. Um, so then, yeah, y'all guys can see the difference. 90 hz is on the right, 120 hz is on the left. And this doesn't this does indeed have a 120 hz refresh rate, so that is very nice. 6.5 inches. Enjoy the view on a big, beautiful Moto G screen. 120 hz refresh rate, like I said. Details are razor sharp and glorious high definition. Full HD plus. Details are razor sharp and glorious high definition. Basically, the same thing I just said. You got told you on the 120 hz refresh rate there. Less bezel, more screen, immerse yourself in the action from edge to edge. Up to 38 hours on a single charge, so that's about a day. That's slightly more than a day and a half of battery, so that's pretty impressive there. Uh, but of course, that will depend on your usage, of course, so to keep that in mind. So as whether you are listening to a playlist, Video chatting with friends or binge watching a new series. The powerful 5000 mAh battery keeps up with everything you do. Alright. Let the light in. Take gorgeous portraits, detail close ups, and flattering selfies with an advanced camera system. Your photos are enhanced by quad pixel technology to sharpen and brighten shots captured in low light settings. So. That's very cool there. Um, visualize the story there. Picture perfect. Your photos come out clear and bright as the 50 megapixel lens sensors adjust to any vantage point and any light for perfect shots. Okay, that's interesting. Huh, 
it's not, it's not, it's not, let me click on it, I don't know why I won't. Screw it. More features. High quality Debbie Outmost audio. Listen to your favorite entertainment on large stage speakers to hear improved bass, clear vocals, and more clarity at higher volume. Keep it all stored. With up to 256 lights of built in storage, you will have plenty of room for photos, movies, songs, apps, and games. Add up to one terabyte more using a micro SD card, which you will have to provide your own micro SD card anyway. Alright? Your phone, your experience. With my UX, control your phone with simple gestures, customize your entertainment settings, and create a look that's all you. So, very nice there. Specs, performance, Android 13 on there. So, um, the, the latest and greatest as I'm recording this video here. So, um, very nice. Processor is a MediaTek Nymph 900 processor, which is octa core processor there. Fingerprint reader, face unlock. Oh, uh, yeah, I think your power button is also your fingerprint sensor. Uh, the storage is 256 gigabytes of internal storage. So a massive upgrade over the previous Moto G Power, which I think it had 128 gigabytes of storage. This one has 256 gigs, so very impressive upgrade there. Up to one terabyte via micro, via micro SD expansion. Sensors like a this size fingerprint reader, proximity gyroscope, XI ROM, the ambient light, side sensor, sensor hub, e compass, your standard sensors there. Oh, it has 6 gigabytes of RAM, so very good. 5,000 mAh battery on board, 10 watt charger, 10 watt charger, 15 watt device charging capable, so you can uh, charge. Uh, you can charge. Uh, 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 you can charge up to 15 watts on this phone here. Um, up to 38 hours on a single charge. That's very nice. Display 6.5 inches LCD display there, so uh, keep that in mind. 120 hertz refresh rate, Full HD plus 1080 by 2400. That is 4 PPI, 20 by 9 aspect ratio. Screen to body ratio, active area body is 84%. Active uh, um, active area body is 84% active area touch panel is 89% design digital dimensions there um PMMA I don't know what that is it has water repellent so it's not waterproof so uh, don't submerge your phone in water uh, 3.5 headphone jack plus type C charging port so you do get a headphone jack which is very nice to see because that's becoming less of a uh, Feature now on smartphones, so it's very nice to have a uh, headphone jack because some people still like to use wired headphones, but you, you can use Bluetooth headphones if you guys want, or whatever. Color options are the color options is a, is a mineral black and a bright white color options. Uh, when this one goes to the US, of course, you guys want to get one color that is that would be the uh, mineral black version because usually most carriers only carry one color. Oh, you're lucky if you get two colors. You're lucky depending on what carrier, maybe. So, uh, most carrier, the most carriers will call it, will carry the mineral black Moto G Power 5G. So keep that in mind. Cameras, you get uh, three of them on the back and a 50 megapixel camera with the f1 with the f1.8 aperture. Quad pixel tech, quad pixel technology, face attacks and all the focus. F two point four. Okay. Face detection on the fact is two megapixel camera, F two point four aperture, two two megapixel depth camera. Alright, so you get a fifty megapixel main camera and you get a depth sensor which is two megapixels and you get a macro camera which is two megapixels as well. Uh, where is camera video software, dual capture, spot color, time lapse, yeah, time lapse, the time lapse of the hyperlapse, 
macro slow motion, step video stabilization, video snapshot, and efficient videos. Full HD recording that on the uh, cameras. Uh, that's the rear. Uh, very camera recording. Alright, so the front facing camera records in 4HD at 30 frames per second. Uh, the main camera records in 4HD at 30 and 60 frames. The macro camera lens records in HD 720p at 30 frames per second. Okay, guys, and then your camera software is yeah, you guys get ultra res, dual capture, spot color, night vision, macro, portrait, live filter, panorama, perma with long exposure. Smart composition, auto smile capture, Google Lens innovation, which is very sweet. Active photos, timer, high res, high res digital zoom up to eight times. Raw photo output, HDR, burst shot, assistive grid, leveler, more mark. 16 megapixel front facing camera with, the FT, with an F2.4 aperture. So, pretty cool there. Uh, front camera software, dual capture, spot color, portrait, live photo, live filter, field of view, switch, primary with long exposure, auto small, capture, just a selfie, active photos, face beauty, timer selfie, and timer selfie, any mason, raw photo output, HDR, assistive grid, level, so, selfie photo mirror. Watermark, brush shot, tap anywhere to capture. So that's pretty cool. Front camera, video software, dual capture, spot color, time lapse of hyperlapse, face beauty, video snapshot, and efficient videos. Audio, stereo speakers, 3.5, headphone jack, and two microphones. Experience, of course, you get Google Assistant, my UX, if you guys want to know what, that's, uh, what that includes here. Personalized theme, wallpaper, uh, personalization is themes on wallpaper display, peak display, attentive display, gestures, quick capture, fast flashlight, three finger screenshot, flip to do not disturb, pick up to silence, lift to unlock, swipe to split, quick launch play, media controls, Game time tips, take a tour, what's new and Android 13, okay. <clears throat> Connectivity, you guys do get 5G of course, 4G, 3G, there is no, uh, there is no NFC, so if you guys use Google Pay and all that, this is not the phone for you, it takes a nano SIM card. Uh, Bluetooth 5.3, Wi Fi 8 to 11 ABG and then AC, Dolby Wi Fi, Wi Fi hotspot, ports 3.5 headphone jack, Type C port, obviously that's pretty much standard, location, services, GPS, A GPS, and all that good stuff. Uh, what comes in the box is a Moto G Power 5G 2023. Blah. What comes in the box is a Moto. G powers and 5G 2023. God damn, I can't talk. What comes in the box is a Meta G Power 5G 2023 version. This is the first Meta G Power to feature 5G. Y'all guys get a charging brick, which is very nice to see. You Type C cable. I think it's probably it's probably Type C to Type C. I'm not really sure about that. Your guides and your some ejection tool there. So, uh, yeah, do you guys have the Moto G Power 5G? has been announced by Motorola. It's coming now, I think, April 13th, I guess. Uh, it is now April 12th because it is now after midnight here on the East Coast. So, uh, yeah, so if you guys are looking to get a budget 5G smartphone from Motorola, the Moto G Power 5G is worth checking now. It has great specs and features. Uh, this is the first Moto G Power to feature 5G, so if you guys like the Moto G Power, 
smartphones. This one has 5G on it, so that's a win. So, well, I'll check it out. Very nice looking phone. Uh, I think the phone's made of plastic. I'm not really sure about that. I don't, I don't really know. Uh, so, well, other than that, it's a nice looking phone. Great features, like I said. And, uh, yeah, it's about time this one got 5G. So, uh, yeah, so if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up, guys. Watch me a lot. Peace, rate, comment, subscribe. Thank you very much for watching my video. And I will catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.